Ready. Okay, what's up guys? It's me, your badass host, Gravity. Welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Sword walkthrough. Okay, so this is the playoff edition. Yeah, they say that last episode. And uh, yeah, in our last episode, we defeated our girlfriend, Nessa, to go into the second round of this playoff edition right here. And, uh, well, yeah, we got a little too cocky. She beat us a little bit. She beat us up a little bit, but... I think we can handle our own right here in this next battle. So let's go right ahead and take on the next challenger, which I would like to say is B, the fighting type gym leader. Mm, 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 mm. She just looks mean. She just, yeah. Okay, so here it is. Ladies and gentlemen, we're already at the second match of the finals. Of the four remaining challengers, which two will be left in the last match? If you're just tuning in, ladies and gentlemen, we are witnessing quite a surprise during the finals here at this year's Champions Cup as the former gym challenger beat Storm at the stage. But Draven had, was having none of it. This year's top challenger made a quick work of him before washing away gym leader Nessa. On the other side, we have, well, Galar's Karate Prodigy. Let's hear it for gym leader B. Hmm, mm, mm, mm. Oh yeah, oh yeah, she's ready to go. I promise you, my attacks will shake your very soul this time. May the best trainer win. Okay, alrighty. Okay, alrighty. <laughs> Let's get it, and she's ready to go. So here it is, Gym Leader B wants the battle. And here she's coming out with Hal Lucha. Oh, Lucha Libra is a big old rooster bird. And here's Dreamzilla ready to go. And, well, we're not going to make that mistake on the last one right here. You might have one, uh, or, yeah, yeah, okay. I'll show you that I'm really serious. Oh, she's really, really serious. I, I just couldn't read that one right here. Okay, let's go. Psychic Fangs for the win. Yeah, buddy, here we go. And that right there hits it pretty hard. And here comes a bounce attack. Okay, so you're going to be bouncing. I got an evasion for that. Phantom Force, let's go. So here we go, Phantom Force, we disappear. Okay, B, bounce attack, doesn't hit us, and just like that, we're gonna hit him with Phantom Force for the win. Okay, and uh, well, B is not that happy right now, and well, we're getting a little more experience points, and she's about to come out with a Surfage. Yeah, not going to happen right here. We're gonna continue on with uh, with uh, Dreepzilla right here. Okay, Surfitch, I've had you before. Yeah, you are one powerful Pokemon. So let's go again with a Psychic Fangs, and that right there will hit Surfitch pretty good. And here comes a brutal swing. That oh my God hits us pretty hard. But luckily for us, we do have. We do have our, uh, you know, our leftovers right here. So let's go straight again with a Psychic Fangs. And just like that, Surfitch has been defeated. Yeah, it, it, it turns out that B should have probably been our first challenger. And here is level 60 for Dreamzilla. And just a little bit more HP. There you go. It's a good thing that we got the leftovers. And no, uh, we're going to continue on right here. And here comes Phalinx. Phalinx. Okay, alrighty. You know what? This calls for a Dragon Dance, and hopefully this Pokemon doesn't have like any kind of Dark type or any kind of crazy ass moves or anything like that. So there we go. We are increasing our attacks just a little bit. Here comes a Rock Tomb attack. This one will hit us pretty good, and well, thankfully we do have the leftovers increasing or giving us back our HP right here. So here we go with a little bit, a little bit of a power up. Psychic Fangs gets Felling just a little bit more, and here comes a Rock Tomb attack. Holy bejeebus. Okay, so, yes. It looks like we're going to need a little bit more than just, like, uh, what was it called? Uh, a Dragon Dance. And Felings has been defeated. Okay, alrighty. There's more experience points right there, and uh, the Leftovers are giving us just a little bit more. And let's see, Grapple Lock. Okay, so Grapple Lock could be a Pokemon that does have a, does have a move right here. So let's see. Let's go, Psychic Fangs. Hopefully this will actually beat this guy. And there we go, Grapple Lock has been defeated. Oh yes, no mercy. 
There's no mercy in this dojo. Yeah, buddy. Alrighty, okay. And the leftovers are helping us. And here comes the Machamp. This Machamp right here is... Yeah, this Machamp is going to be a scary Machamp to actually take on. And... Well, Machamp. Wanting to be Machamp. Hmm. You know what? Let's go with Psychic Fangs because I... I do have a feeling if this Pokemon Gigantamax is right here, it's going to try and use a Dark-type move. Hopefully this one attack can actually hit it, but... Look at this. It's Gigantamax form, and it's looking pretty... Oh my god, pretty scary right here. Level 54 Machamp. And near its championship belt, it is uh, turning into like a... Oh wow, and that right there hits it pretty hard. And here comes a Max Flare attack. This one will actually... Oh, wow. This one will actually uh, help us survive. Okay. Okay, so... <laughs> there is a... There is no defeating this Pokemon right here. So here we go. Let's go with Psychic Fangs. And just like that, Monchamp has been defeated. So, yeah. Dreepsilla sweeps the whole team. That's how you do it. And, well, your strength nearly made me want to turn and run into my bare feet. Oh, yes. And, well, there's a little bit of a prize. Because of this little sweep. What? Dreepsilla is evolving. Holy crud. So it took us quite a while, guys. It took us like maybe 30 episodes or more, but here it is. Dreepzilla has evolved into Dragapult. The ultimate form right here. Let's go ahead and take a look at its uh at its Pokedex. What a what a good way to end a match right here. And it's like Dragapult, the stealth Pokemon. Well, 9 feet 10 inches. 110 pounds of pure muscle. When it isn't battling, it keeps Dreepy in its holes and its horn. Once it fights, uh, once a fight starts, it launches a Dreepy like a supersonic missile. Okay. And, well, it is learning Dragon Darts right here. So let's go right ahead and take a look at what Dragon Darts are. Like, you know, is it a special? Oh, no, it's a physical one. Uh, oh, wow. Okay, so this is a little tough. The user attacks twice using Dreepy. If uh, there are two targets in this move, okay. Uh, okay, so I'm going to switch... I'm definitely going to switch Dragon Pole for Dragon Darts for just this moment. I can always learn it back. And, well, there we go. And Dragon Darts have been learned. Okay. B has been defeated. Challenger Draven has shown his skill. And she bows to us. Thank you for a wonderful match. I really enjoyed battling you and your team. I'm upset that I lost, but I also uh, feel so satisfied and, refer and refreshed. In a way, I guess you could say it was the best sort of match anyone could ever hope for. I hope that you meet many more trainers and have many more matches in the future. And I hope in it that every one of those encounters will nourish your spirit. The next match will begin in no time. Stay, so stay in those seats, folks. And just like that, Ryan has defeated Pierce. Oh, wow. So we got one more battle, and that's against, well, good old Ryan right there. Ryan has glor gloriously defeated Pierce. Okay, alrighty, so... Sis, you shouldn't be forcing your way in here. Sorry, Draven. I thought my bro could get revenge for me, but he lost to Ryan. You look so sloppy out there that people are gonna think we're both weak because uh, we, we're related. You got it wrong, sis. Ryan's uh, that strong, but I was able to show everyone in the audience how amazing a proper battle uh, without using Dynamax can be. All right, I get it, but that's exactly why I wanted you to win. I still thought it was a brilliant battle, though. I'm counting on you to win, Draven. Got that? I'll be cheering for you. Sorry to come, uh, or sorry to come in for a chin wag just before the final batch. Ryan's waiting for you in the pitch. We're looking forward to uh, for a, a good battle. Okay, so let's go right ahead and take a look at our newest Pokemon, Dreepzilla. 
or Dragapult, I think. That's what it is. Yeah, Dragapult. Look at this. We've been waiting for this Pokemon for quite some time, guys. This is the reason why we had him in an egg and all that crud. So, as you can see, guys, this Pokemon is, uh, is a pretty darn good one. It is super fast, and its stats are pretty damn good, and its clear body is pretty darn good. And, uh, well, I cannot wait to use him in the next battle because we're going to be taking on some pretty strong Pokemon right here. So, yes, guys, we are stopping the episode right here. Thank you guys again for watching. In the next episode, we will be taking on Raihan one more time for the right to take on Leon. Stay tuned, guys. It's going to get good. See you guys.